Hi friends, today we're going to learn what's inside our bodies with our good friend Simon. Everyone say hello to Simon. Hello Simon. Are you ready to explore and play? Okay, let's go. First, let's help Simon get ready. We're going to remove his outside parts, like his arms. His legs. His torso. And his head. Now we can see the inside space for all his organs. That's where we'll place all the important parts that help him and us live, move, and grow. Let's start with the head. Hmm, what goes in the head? A banana? No, silly, that's for snack time. Oh, I know, a brain. Yes, that's right. Now, which one is the brain? Is it this wrinkly, squishy pink one? Yep, that's it. Let's put the brain in. The brain is like the boss of your body. It tells everything what to do. It helps you think, remember, and even decide which flavor ice cream you like. Yum! Next up, the heart. Is this big red one the heart? Ding, 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 yes it is. Where does the heart go? In your foot? No way. It goes right here in your chest. The heart is like a little strong pump. It pushes blood all through your body, all day, even when you're sleeping. It works so hard and never takes a nap. Let's keep going. This is the liver and gallbladder. These two are a team. The liver is big and brownish, kind of like a big soft sponge. The liver helps clean your blood and keeps your body from getting yucky stuff inside. It's your body's superhero filter. Now the gallbladder is this little green buddy next to it. It stores special juices to help you digest your food. Especially pizza. Mmm, now I'm hungry. Time for the pancreas. It looks a bit like a curly banana. But where does it go? This one's kind of sneaky. It hides behind the stomach. Time to put it where it belongs. The pancreas helps turn the food you eat into energy so you can run, jump, and dance like a silly noodle. Now, let's find another important organ. Here, we have the bladder. Where do you think it goes? Hmm, that's a tough one. But I think it goes here, way down low in the tummy. The bladder looks like a little balloon. The bladder holds your pee until it's time to go to the bathroom. Think of it like your body's water bottle, but not the kind you drink from, you. Here comes the lungs. We have two lungs, one for each side of the chest. They look like fluffy pillows. Let's put them in. The lungs help you breathe in fresh air and blow out stuff your body doesn't need. They're like little air balloons inside your chest. Inhale, exhale. Time for the intestines. Whoa, look at this long twisty thing. It's not a spaghetti noodle. It's just your intestines. They help turn the food you eat into tiny bits your body can use. Then they help you get rid of what's left. Yep, that's right, they help you poop. Okay, only one more puzzle piece left. The stomach and spleen.
The stomach, it looks like a little pink bag. It holds the food you eat and starts to break it down. Kind of like a bubble bath for your lunch. And the spleen? It's tiny but mighty. It helps your body fight off germs. Like a tiny ninja hiding inside your belly. Okay, all the organs are in the right spot. But wait, Simon's still missing something. Let's give him back his arms. One. Two. Now his legs. One. Two. Here comes his torso to cover everything up nice and snug. And finally, his head. Can't forget that. There, Simon is all back together. Inside and out. Hooray! Wow, that was interesting. We learned so much about what's inside our bodies. We found out what each organ does and where it belongs. The brain helps us think. The heart keeps our blood moving. The lungs help us breathe. The stomach and intestines help with food digestion. And the liver, pancreas, and spleen all work behind the scenes to help keep us healthy. Even the bladder has an important job. Our bodies are so amazing. And now you know why. Let's thank Simon for helping us today. Thanks, Simon! We'll see you next time for more fun and learning videos. Bye! For more videos, please like and subscribe.